I think I think something they can do to make this game infinitely better is look at the maps and think about like oh what maps are like a characters are like a must play on this map and how can we like change the map in a way that the character goes from like a must play to good but then also allows for other people to like be effective on the map because like i would say for icebox in particular you need to have kj kj vipers like a must and that's just like how the map is but i wonder what they could do to the game to like make it so there isn't must picks in the game i think that's like the shittiest thing about valorant and the reason why it's like also really boring and stagnant is there's just certain things where oh you have to play this character you're forced to play this character if you're not playing this character you're controlling it's like the reason why people are forced to have an ascent sova every map it's because you can just hold b main shock dart the thing wall bang with an odin and that's like one of the reasons why like the character is an op and like really really strong oh if there is no must plays in this game i think the game would be better but i i do think that's a result of the map design the maps is the map design doesn't allow for you to have like creativity with your comps because i mean they have the fundamental part there with like all the different agents and stuff but like why in pro play is there like a certain comp or like a certain set of agents picked 99 percent of the time over other characters I like the ascent comp yeah basically the ascent comp is like the most basic like one and the most like basic theory of that it is only essential on xbox i was just i was just talking about how like certain characters are essential in certain maps like kj is essential in icebox the that one comp on uh ascent is like essential in ascent it's just way better um viper is essential on icebox viper was essential on breeze viper is essential on um i mean i guess people make way without playing it on bind but like it's op as on bind but yeah it's just it's just the way they have certain stuff they should work it in a way where you're allowed to play other stuff mm -mm. agent bands would be cool i i in my honest opinion i think they could already experiment with agent bands in my personal opinion i think they could probably like set a thing where you can ban one agent because that would like drastically change how certain compositions are played and then also like evolve valorant in from like not like a tactical shooter with like abilities where everyone does the same shit over and over but like it would kind of change up how the games look and make them more chaotic in a sense and i do think i think there's a good chaos and a bad chaos and right now i think valorant's in a spot of bad chaos just because everything is so like basic everything is so like like what is it called it's so like cookie cutter and it's kind of like disgusting because it's cookie cutter like I, I don't know i think i think valorant should lean into the lean into more of like creativity of players creativity of comps and that's how i think the game would flourish more rather than just being like budget counter strike on certain maps like i don't want to see the same sets of util every single round i don't want to play 131 scrims of like the same exact fucking composition because it's just way better than other compositions like I, I do think that if you were able to come up with more shit like come up with more, more cool stuff and seeing like more agents played more it'd be really cool <laughs> no map ban first stop yeah there already is map bans what do you mean <laughs> it's like a dull and stale cookie cutter yeah it, it's very stale and i think that's i think that's valorant's like issue at the moment in my opinion is the game is stale and needs like a spicing up isn't that what cs is though i mean yeah but i'm saying valorant should lean in a way that's not cs R right now they're doing a thing where it's like like okay wh what i'm trying to say is in cs you're always watching the same utility flash smoke molly nade and like a decoy i guess I don't think you should have that in Valorant at all times and there shouldn't be like essential compositions that you need to run and it's kind of like that where I mean mainly in particular for like Ascent for that like Ascent's probably the biggest uh criminal for that because there's like a composition that you have to run but I feel like on certain maps 
the reason why they also feel really bad to play is because you need essential characters in those comps no matter what no matter what composition you run you have to run this character on this comp and then that's what makes it feel like shit in my opinion haven honestly i'm so tired of playing role characters right now it just ends up in losses all the time the best way to play ranked is just playing duelist and just running it down honestly actually haven haven has a haven also has a basic pitch comp it's the sova breach duelist omen and like kj cypher yeah that's why they're adding new characters to those mini <laughs> no one plays the other options because the other options are just bad the maps are designed for the characters that are currently in play and not designed for like the new characters because the characters came after the map the map probably came before the characters they're dropping 30 every rain again yeah no honestly play reina just go shoot stuff and then if you get utility then all good